And I don't think I need to reiterate what many of you already know that human trafficking is a very, very, very serious and very real matter in this country. And a lot of people don't really want to think about it, but even a community like Rochester is played with it as well. It may not be as widespread as they may be in much larger cities, but I'm often reminded about the fact that Rochester is a city, and it's a city that has many of the same problems as many other cities across this country, and human trafficking is one of them. I could stand here and talk to you about it all day, because I've worked in it in a variety of different positions. But the only thing I want to be able to do today is really encourage all of you to take part, continue to take part in making sure that we try to protect these young people. There are women, there are young girls, but there are also boys. And we have to keep in mind this just really affects the lives of a lot of people. It destroys families, it destroys communities, it destroys neighborhoods. And thankful for folks like yourself and other people across this state and around the country, it really does make a difference. It makes a huge difference. Because if we were not doing anything in an attempt to either prevent or stop or go after those that are involved, this would go totally unnoticed. Because it is one crime oftentimes that goes unnoticed because it occurs under the cloak of darkness, if you will. But we have to pay attention to it, we have to be aware of it, and it's in every community across this country. Not in just some communities, but it's a real serious issue in communities all across this great nation. So, thank you all for being here. Thank you all for the great work that you're doing on behalf of Mayor Lovely Warren and myself. And God bless you. Thank you. Thank you.